So what is MailChimp and how does it work? Allow me to very quickly explain and then I'll showcase some of how MailChimp works on the inside. So MailChimp is a comprehensive marketing automation platform that enables businesses to create, send, and analyze email and ad campaigns. It was founded in 2001 and initially started as an email marketing service, but has since expanded to include a wide range of tools for managing customer relationships and running targeted marketing campaigns. MailChimp's platform offers features such as email templates, audience segmentation, A-B testing, and analytics, and so much more to help users optimize their marketing efforts. Additionally, it provides integrations with other platforms and services, allowing businesses to streamline their marketing operations and reach their audiences more effectively. MailChimp is also designed for businesses of all sizes, from small startups to large enterprises, as well as for individual marketers looking to enhance their marketing strategies. Its user-friendly interface and customizable features make it accessible to those with varying levels of marketing expertise. Small business owners, entrepreneurs, and marketers can leverage MailChimp to grow their email list, engage with customers, and increase brand awareness. Furthermore, its scalable pricing structure, which includes the ability to try them for free with basic features, makes it an attractive option for businesses with different budgetary needs. Now, allow me to show you how MailChimp works very quickly. All right, so first and foremost, something I didn't talk about in the intro in the description, MailChimp can allow you to create signup forms and landing pages, which can be beneficial for obviously gathering your leads. Here's an example about when we want to create a newsletter signup. I'm gonna click on begin. From here, we have some templates that we can utilize, but for this specifically, I'm just gonna go with the grow your list one. And here, this is gonna be the drag and drop editor that you can use that once it's done, this is where you can collect your leads. If you want to change anything, simply click on it and go right here to add your headline. The same thing goes with a lot of the text right here. We can click on it and this is gonna be where you change your text. And of course, when it comes to actually gathering subscribers, we have the box right here. You can collect the email address. Of course, if you want, you can add more like first name, last name, address, phone number, as well as birthday. And of course, we have some information that when someone clicks subscribe, what do they do? They can get a confirmation message. They can go to another landing page or web address, but let's just keep it on the confirmation message. And it says, success, you've been added to the audience. Pretty simple stuff. Let's click on save and close. And of course, this isn't a real full example, just showcasing how you can use their drag and drop editor to create landing pages or just newsletter signup forms. Let's click save and close. And last but not least, we click on publish and we're gonna have our signup form ready just like that. And there we go, there's just a very quick example of the newsletter signup form that I created. This is gonna be beneficial for you collecting leads because of course, once you do that, you can send emails to them. A very big part of MailChimp, allow me to show you how that works as well. So based on the best practices, we have created a landing page. You can utilize automation, but more specifically, I just wanna show you how to write a very quick regular email. Pretty simple to do. Let's click on design email. All right, and right before we go about creating our newsletter, what we have is we can send it to specific recipients. Obviously, that's gonna be up to you. We have our from email. We have our subject line, which we can obviously change around the time we wanna send it. And of course, last but not least is gonna be our email content. Let's click on design email. And MailChimp comes with a plethora of email templates. As you can see here, I'm gonna scroll down, just keep going and going and going. So depending on what your needs are gonna be, if you wanna make them spiffy or not. Personally, I like starting from scratch. I like them being mostly focused about text, especially when it comes to newsletters. That's my style, but yours might differ. Let's click on apply. As you can see, we have our logo up at top and all you need to do here, very similar to the landing page editor or the signup form editor is just add your text in there. And if you're gonna notice it's gonna be centered, we can obviously change that around. So our email is gonna go right here where we add it in, obviously. We sign off at the end. I'm not gonna actually put the email there, but in case you wanted to write it out, that's where it's gonna be. For any other sections here we don't wanna add, we can always delete them and then go back over here and drag and drop anything that we want. We can add buttons over here. We can add videos, like a YouTube video, in case you wanna embed it. You can add spacers and dividers in case you wanna add that in between and edit around and so on and so forth. It's pretty straightforward and in my opinion, I like that. It definitely has an ease of use when it comes to using it. So even if you don't have a lot of experience with email marketing in terms of creating them or designing them, MailChimp will definitely help you out with that. Let's click on save and exit. All right, and of course, we've walked through everything else that you need to do in creating an email. We have our content. It added the badge there, obviously, so when you start your free trial, it will remove that, but last but not least, all you need to do is simply click on send. And that's a very quick walkthrough in terms of MailChimp. I hope that helps you understand what it's going to be, what it's all about, and of course, what it can help you with when it comes to your online business, your online marketing, and more specifically, email marketing in general. If you have any other questions about MailChimp, feel free to leave a comment down below. My name is James. Thank you so much for watching this video, and I will see you in my next one.